we're here learning about the Blue Team Village at DEF CON 30. So what is the Blue Team Village? Well, the Blue Team Village <laughs> is the defensive side of hacking, which uh, I think it's kind of a newer thing that, that uh, you know, that DEF CON's been doing for the last five years, but it's our fifth anniversary, so we're kind of trying to go big and, and go bold. I know this place is huge. There's talks yeah. going on yeah. <laughs> constantly over here. Yeah. There's the CTF over here. There's tons going on. So if I'm, a, if I'm a noob, never been here before, and I come to this village, is there things which I can learn here? Yeah, absolutely. So uh, this year we're doing something completely new that is homegrown. Uh, it's called Project Obsidian. And what it essentially is, is there are two stations, which are kind of against that wall, and they're all mini workshops that you can work through. And what, what it essentially is, is we developed this whole kill chain. And yeah. each workshop is a different perspective on the kill chain. So we've got like, here's the incident response side looking at the kill chain data. Here's uh, malware analysis on the same data. So it provides a continuity for all of the different aspects that you could approach it from. And those are, those, so those are the Project of City workshops. They're all listed on the uh, schedule.blueteamvillage.com, or .org, sorry. <laughs> um, at the same time, we also have a, li a stage where we're doing some live walkthroughs of the same Project Obsidian stuff. That, all the Project Obsidian stuff is like 10.30 to 3 p.m. Okay. At 3 p.m., we're actually rolling over into live panels. So this year, we decided to step away from talks, because we think talks are a little bit too one-sided, and we want to get that yeah. conversational aspect. So we're doing some really awesome in-person panels. Yeah. 3 p.m. today, we're doing uh, threat hunting at scale. Uh, right after that, we're doing leveling up your security skills, which is really focused on, on your you know, progression in your mm -hmm. technical abilities. At 5 p.m., I'm actually running a cloud panel on the cloud GFIR and engineering around that. I'm a big cloud person. Um, and then tomorrow, we also have um, uh, challenges and control validation at 3 p.m. Uh, then we have making your sock suck less. Oh which is, that was going to be really fun. I know a lot of people are looking forward to that one. And then we're going to close it out with uh, latest and greatest in incident response. Uh, um, but you've covered a ton. So I'm going to push back a little bit because there's so much going on. Yeah. I want to jump back to, you said there's like kind of these modules going back through the, uh, mm -hmm. the, at the attack chain. Are those things anyone can do at home or is that only at Yeah, time? so we're actually going to be doing this year round. Really? This whole project, everything's going to be, all the recordings are going to be posted online afterwards. Um, and it's just gonna, it's gonna be something where people can join the conversation. So if you go to blueteamvillage.org, we have a link to our Discord server where uh, you can participate year round. Um, and we have a whole Project Obsidian group. You can interact, there's a, a small CCF going on as well. Um, that's more information about that on the website by, as well. By the way, I am absolutely floored that you're like, we're able to keep this conversation going. <laughs> there is legitimately, right behind the camera, like 15 people coming up and down. This whole room is filled with hundreds of people. <laughs> like. Uh, kudos to you because even I'm <laughs> struggling with this. You're, you're getting the harder job because you're talking so much. <laughs> so, no, you know, it's a lot of fun. And like, I, Blue Team Village is really about taking people where they are and helping them get to the next level, building their confidence in their technical abilities. And also, I mean, Blue Team Village is the closest aligned to like what, what the industry, like what an industry is. So we want to make sure that we kind of get people involved and really and help them develop those skills. So it, that's our whole mission. I do have a question. <laughs> I'm, I'm, we were just at the Red Team Village, <laughs> and now we're at the Blue Team Village. And it is, is there a rivalry there, or is this kind of like... There's no rivalry. I have no idea what you're talking about. <laughs> 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 I am laughing because you start looking at the two villages and you start seeing people like feel like they're taking sides and whatnot. Def Con, I don't know, they have the red shirts, so I'm not. Am I allowed in here? No. With well, yeah, we wouldn't be we wouldn't be here without the red side. The red side wouldn't be with, here without us. And you know, we're either gonna like walk into the hallway and have a little you know foam sword fight with the, between the blue-haired <laughs> people and the red-haired people, or hey, maybe we'll just like do some crossover and make purple team village and everyone will be happy. There you go. But, so yeah. <laughs> with, with some of the cha uh, challenges, seeing so going through the t attack chain, when you're going through, is there some people there to be able to like help you through them, or are they mm -hmm. are like are these made for experts, or this is made for like anyone who just wants to go ahead and get started? We're really trying to make it uh, um, approachable content that anyone can access. So a lot of them are really focused on kind of like just that, that introductory. Um, the stations, we have some pre-recorded content that people are listening to with headphones, but we also have people available to answer questions. Okay. And um, on the main stage right now, we're also doing live walkthroughs where it's a little bit, you know, it's less hands-on and more of like explaining about kind of what, what's actually going on. So, you know, it, we kind of have a little bit of, of everything. 
Um, and again, like I mentioned, it's going to be a year-round thing. So you know, eventually we're hoping to expand it to the point where we have a, a content that's approachable from whatever level someone is at. Okay. And where can they go to learn more about us? Blueteamvillage.org. Oh, that's an easy one to remember. Yeah. <laughs> well, hey, I know you're running about. You have so much else to do. Oh, Gallery, you had a question. Oh, how long have you been coming to DEF CON? Oh, so this is actually my fifth year because I started as a Blue Team Village volunteer and privilege escalated my way to director. Well, okay, hold on. <laughs> how did that happen? Like, how did you go about... <laughs> how, I need to hear that. So I just, I knew one of the guys who, who created this, uh, Vayox, this is his handle. And uh, I just volunteered the first year and I'm like, I, I think volunteering is such a great way to get introduced to DEF CON because there's just so much going on. Mm -hmm. So it's easier to start somewhere when you start as a volunteer. So, and I just stuck around and then suddenly it was like, oh, I'm willing to do these things. Okay, I guess I'm a director now. <laughs> I love how those stories happen. You're like, oh yeah, I, I started, I came to the village, I volunteered and now I run that. <laughs> this, yeah. this is incredible. Thank you so much. Thank you for taking yeah. the time to talk to me. Like there is really so much going on. Thanks for watching and hack on.